Hello, this is Crystal, and I am preparing um, some Christmas baskets. We are going to my mother-in-law's, well, my in-laws for Christmas Eve. Um, I did get my nails done. Um, I thought I would be festive and forego the black. <laughs> so they're red with gold because um, I have a New Year's Eve gown, which I will show you on the night of New Year's Eve that I'm, I'm going to be wearing because we're going to a really formal uh, party. So, yeah, this gown is uh, pretty much it, it hits the floor. So it's a pretty cool gown. I think you guys are going to like it. And then I did get my toes done. Okay, so that's what I've been up to this morning. And then yesterday, the reason why I didn't vlog at all is because I was baking like a maniac. Now, I did go to... Um, this tin is from the Dollar Tree, and this is for our awesome neighbor that brought us those halos when we were sick, and I did not have a tin, and I don't know if you guys have been to the 99 cent store lately, but pretty much everything Christmas is gone. I mean, you can't even find tissue paper, so, um, we had to run to the Dollar Tree today so that I could put her cookies in a tin, and I baked her, um, six big chocolate chip cookies from Annie's Organic that I had in my freezer. And my baking came out pretty awesome. Um, these are really big cookies. The bag is from the 99 cent store and I just sealed it and I really like how it's super Christmassy. Um, I did not go to the 99 cent store at all yesterday but I did send my husband quite a few times and he picked out these cute little fox napkins so I'm just going to wrap that in there and put the top on and as you guys all know I like kind of a traditional Christmas or like a black Christmas I know you know what I'm a Gemini I have really weird taste so this tin caught my eye because it's old style and it says seasons greetings you got some pretty presents there and this is from the Dollar Tree and also I did um, pick up some stuff for giveaways at the Dollar Tree so I picked up three of these and this is one this is Holly Jolly Christmas. I picked this up on Friday from my vlog. And I'm just going to put some tissue paper in. Like I said, there is not any tissue paper to be found. I don't even know where my husband went to get this tissue paper. I'm hoping he didn't pay a fortune for it. And this is also from the 99 cent store. We've all recognized this. Um, this is awesome holiday spice tea. There's eight bags. This is gingerbread spice tea, eight bags. And this is peppermint. So I'm going to put that in there, and of course it doesn't fit, so I'm going to have to rearrange this and try and fit it in. Okay, and I, I'm also including this 10 ounce boxed mug, this is also from the 99 cent store, Coffee Makes Me Merry. So I think that's going to be really turn out cute, I'm going to give her the coffee mug and the tin of chocolate chip cookies. And I'm gonna, I hopefully it all fits in here. If not, I'll do something else. So let me see what I can do. Oh, and then I have a whole bunch of my Rice Krispie treats with different, I have like the chocolate ones. I have the mini Marsh, the M&M chocolate ones. So I might strew in a couple of those in there loosely. Um, I did that for my husband's aides and they all really enjoyed it. So let's see how I'm going to fit this in. Okay, this sounds so bad, but I don't know her name, and neither does my husband. So, I'm just decorating it like this, and then I just put a little mittens to seal it. Um, it's all not going to fit in the basket, but I was able to get the mug in, and the stack of tea, and some loose Rice Krispie treats. So, I'm just going to tape this on top of the tin, or I might just stick this in there. I don't know. Yeah, I think I'm just going to stick it in there because I really like how the tin looks. And I'll send my husband over there. Maybe we'll all go over there to give it to her. So, that is one of my Christmas baskets out of the way. Now, for his father, we picked out from Ross. We got an excellent price. They're usually $45 and it's $19.99. And these are Perry Alice Portfolio Shoes. Um, what I like is that they have a really nice um, grip, which will make it um, more difficult for him to fall. Um, his father is elderly. His father is 85. 
So, and he also is diabetic. So when you're diabetic, you need to wear closed toed shoes. And, um, when we are dealing with geriatric patients or just elderly people, it is really nice to have, um, grips so that, um, that will eliminate chances of slipping or falling. And we chose these because we felt that he could wear these at home and outside as well and great for comfort. And they also stretch, um, in case you, you know, feet get swollen and so forth. So this was definitely a great buy. Um, we did save, let's see, we saved, um, it says $45. We paid 20 So, like, what, we saved 25 about, yeah, about $25. So, I'm just gonna, of course, clip that off, and I'm gonna put it in a bag. And we're also giving his parents some other items, too. Okay, so this is the bag that my husband chose for his father, and, um, like I said, there's not any tissue paper, Christmas tissue paper to be found. So I am working with what my husband brought me and I feel that this complements it because we have um, this reindeer and I'm using, I guess it's a teal blue. So I'm thinking that looks okay. And yeah, so that is one of the presents for his parents. Now, we did go to Bath and & Body, and we got his mom this beautiful silver bag. Um, it kind of looks like an emoji, like it's winking, but I um, absolutely fell in love with it. And I love how it's teal, and then it has a teal tassel. It's just so cute. Um, this was, let's see, $30.50, which is pretty decent for Bath & Body, um, because it did come with the full-size magic in the air and see the glitter awesome and this is shea ultra shea body cream and their ultra shea body cream rocks and this is eight ounces and it's also teal inside so i figured of course she could use this as a makeup bag i mean there's so many different uses she's also a seamstress she could put you know sewing items in here and then this is magic in the air shea and vitamin shower gel 10 fluid ounces and again, you have like the sparkles, and yeah, I mean alone that is twelve fifty. We dropped. I mean, my husband spent some money at Path and Body. I'm not going to even lie. Okay, and then of course it came with the full size body spray, and I just think that's gorgeous. I actually have this myself, and I don't think I've used it yet. But this is one of the fragrances I chose, and this is eight fluid ounces, and so you got. Three full-size items, the lotion, the spray, and the um, shower gel, plus this awesome bag for $30. I thought that was a pretty good deal. So, um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to leave it in the Bath & Body, um, the Bath & Body bag, and just put tissue paper in there, and put her, um, gorgeous bag and stuff in there. Okay, so you will probably recognize this from the 99 cent store. Obviously, our picture was not at the 99 cent store, but this box is from the 99 cent store. And I just thought it was cool because that way we could give her a picture of us and she could use this box any way she wants to. Um, and I did mess up. I put the picture in the reverse, but I'm not going to take it out because unfortunately, um, oh, I might have to take it out. Maybe I can. Yeah, I have to fix this. Okay. But that's the picture of us that I am putting in for his mother. And then, um, we also, I'm going to be showing you, I need to bring out my Yankee candles because, uh, we're also giving her a Yankee candle that's been personalized. Okay, so I was able to fix the picture, and I actually put it right so that when she opens it, everything's cool. I did have to tape it. Um, if you do purchase this, um, I would, I mean, it said a 4x6 picture, but it's not true. I had to actually lift up um, and kind of break it apart, and that's why I'm having to tape it back. But still, it's a cute, um, I mean, you could put in a smaller picture um, that's something I would definitely do next time, but, um, his, his mom will definitely like this. Okay. And what I did is I stuck, like I said, um, 
the makeup bag with all the cool stuff in it is just going to go in the Bath and Body Works. And since I have funky uh, tissue paper, I thought I would just bounce this green off of the green that's already there. And it looks cute, so that works. And then I did show you guys this a while back, and this is the Feliz Navidad from uh, Yankee Candle. And then we personalized it with a picture of us at Rock and Brews with Ollie. If you're not familiar with Rock and Brews, it's actually owned by Kiss, and it's um, very similar to Hard Rock Cafe. And what's awesome is this is actually, it says Yankee Candle Company, and the rest, this was the only candle that came with this type of um, engraving on it. And it smells awesome. I mean, if I could, I would keep it for myself. But it's not for me. So I need to get that into some type of... I'm not sure what I'm going to put this in yet. Okay, so with this present, I'm more concerned about getting it there safely. Um, I decided to use the bigger Bath & Body Works bag. And the candle is in there along with the picture of us. So this is his mom's two presents, which I think are pretty awesome. Um... She has the large $27.99 candle from Yankee, and then we got her that um, satchel. I want to say satchel, but it's not a satchel. Um, I guess it's like a cosmetic carrier. If, I don't know what to call it, but it has, um, it's, it's awesome. I'm at a loss for words. I'm sorry. I'm like, my mind's going a million a million directions at once because I have to get ready and we just have like so much to do. So, okay, those are two, these two are done. Yay. Okay, so I get emails, I'm sure a lot of you do, from um, Bath and Body and these are really cute. This says on, this just says Glam On and let me see. These were, I think this was like the 10 under, 1050. And then we have Enjoy, oops enjoy the little things and then we got um, almost perfect yes so this is for his ex sister-in-law and I picked this one out because I thought it was super cute and I'm actually be giving her a mug as well from the 99 cent store wouldn't it be funny if she watches my uh, if she watches my channel and she doesn't even know it's me Okay, I chose a thousand wishes. I was really limited on um, what I could pick because once people found out that they could get, you know, stuff for ten dollars from Bath and Body, it was flying. Now this was a little bit more expensive. This was this was twenty. I think I could have found something better for twenty dollars, but my husband doesn't do really well at Bath and Body for too long of a period of time, so we kind of needed to get out. So it's basically the same concept except travel size and it's in a thousand wishes um, this is actually uh, this doesn't even match huh? Uh, this is shea butter coconut oil oh it is a thousand wishes I want to smell this actually because I don't have the lotion myself if I like it I'm gonna go get the lotion it smells awesome okay and like I said, um, I mostly picked out fragrances that I that I liked because I'm hoping that they will like them. So this is for the sister-in-law. And what else is in here? Oh, cool. Um, I didn't even notice this. The um, Bath and Body Thousand Wishes Antibacterial. Okay. And like I said, she is getting a mug. I'm, I'm looking for my mugs right now for the 99 cent store. And I'm going to be putting it in the basket and then also for her daughter is getting one of these I'm not sure which one yet okay so these are really cute for 1050 um, it comes with the antibacterial and it comes with the ultra shea and the ultra shea alone by itself is six dollars and I think I forget how much these go for but um, this was ten fifty, and of course, like I said, I'm not sure if I'm going to give her Glam On or Enjoy the Little Things. I might give her Enjoy the Little Things because I like this little Christmas tree. That way I don't have to write out another card. Um, so yeah, and I think, um, she's like a teenager, so I, 
I think I'm going to go with a thousand wishes and keep the vanilla to the side. Okay, so I did choose the red one and I'm going to put it in her little basket. And yes, I am a nerd. I am wearing my um, nerdy little leggings that were $3.98 from Walmart because um, I did not get all dressed up just to go, you know, get my nails done. Uh, but we did make a couple stops. Like I said, we had to go to Dollar Tree and so forth, and that was like crazy. But the 99 cent store, my husband said, was super crazy yesterday. Yesterday, I did not leave the house because I was so busy baking. I mean, like, just crazy baking. So anyways, okay, so she's getting a mug and a little treat from Bath and Body. And I absolutely love these Rice Krispies because I just kind of strew them around. And she can eat those later. And they're just kind of really easy to stick in. Kind of like space fillers. There you go. So, that's what I'm doing with this. And I'll show you what else we got at, well, I got at Bath and Body. Because you guys all know I love Bath and Body. Okay. And... I'll leave that out so we know who it's going to. And those are, okay, so it's two of my, no, three of my baskets. All right, I got three of my baskets done. Yay. All right. Um, okay, so we had, um, if you buy, um, you buy something and you get a, an item that for $10 for free. Yeah. So basically they gave us this for free. This 1050, the Glam On, and that has the warm vanilla in, in there. And then what I got for myself was um, a coconut mint drop fragrance mist, and this is a, this is awesome. This is three fluid ounces. I shouldn't say I got for myself. Um, I got some for a giveaway, and this is French lavender and honey. I have not even seen this. I, mean, I didn't even smell it. Like I said. My husband has very limited time span when we go to Bath and Body, so. And, of course, I got myself another little um, a bottle of A Thousand Wishes. Um, so, these are mine, and, yeah, those are mine. And, let's see. Okay, I have more, but those are my three baskets so far, and I think they're coming along really cute. I cannot wait to give the neighbor um, the homemade cookies and so forth. And I think I showed you guys I did get these cards, but I wanted to ask you guys. You know, I really think there should be a disclaimer, because there are... Look at You open it up. Beautiful on the outside. But then you open it up, and it says, Joy to the World, where it should be in the center. And I understand, yes, I paid 99 cents for eight cards, but at least let me know that, you know... I mean, I'd rather have a blank card, and those of you who have received cards from me know that I do write personalized cards, so I don't have a problem, you know, writing my own cards, but I just think that, you know, the buyer should be able to decide if they want um, to purchase a card that has the writing all the way up there, because it's just kind of weird, in my opinion, but let me know if you guys had that problem at your 99 cent store, please comment below. All right, you guys, I need to start getting ready. It is 1.20, and my husband wants to leave at 4.30, and it takes me about three hours to get ready. Um, I'm going to do some quick stuff that I need to get done, and then I'm going to come back on because I have a whole brand new outfit that I bought to wear tonight, and I want to show you guys uh, what I look like and um, what I did with my makeup, and I'll let you guys know what's from the 99 cent store and all that fun stuff. But, um, if you're not, if you watch this tonight, I hope you all have a wonderful Christmas Eve. If you watch it tomorrow, Merry Christmas. And, um, I just want to let you guys know that, um, we're doing really well. And I can't wait to see what the new year brings. And we're going to have some fun on this channel. Uh, I mean, we always have fun on this channel. But, uh, we're going to do like a New Year's type of, um, I'm going to do like a New Year's resolution, and, and you can tell me your resolution, or you can decide to keep it, you know, to yourself, and just say I made one, and, but we'll do like comments like that, and 
yeah, I mean, I'm definitely going to tell you guys my New Year's resolution, and um, I'm going to be back on in a couple hours, and um, I will show you what my husband bought me as a Christmas outfit, and yeah, as always, have a great day and a great evening, and I cannot stress enough how much I appreciate everyone watching the comments. I mean, 71 thumbs up on my hauls. I mean, that's just awesome. And, um, I really hope, I really hope you guys do enjoy this channel because I really do enjoy doing these hauls and including you in, you know, I mean, I'm trying to uh, branch out into vlogging and I know, um, I'm new at this, so I'm not very good, but, um, I'm going to try and talk my husband into, uh, getting me a camera that records, like, not just doing this on my phone, but a camera, because Valentine's Day is around the corner. All right, I will see you in a couple hours.